Hey everybody, this is Pastor Ken. I pray that you're doing well and that you're having a phenomenal day. I just wanted to stop by and to give you some information about the reopening of Restoration House International. As you know, on Wednesday, our governor uh, stated uh, that he will begin stage one of the Maryland Strong Roadmap to Recovery, which means that houses of worship could gather uh, at 50% capacity. Now, and I know that many churches uh, have already started having these conversations about gathering this weekend or over the next couple of weeks. Uh, but as your pastor, I have not only the responsibility to care for your soul, but I'm also concerned about your safety and well-being. And with that being said, Restoration House will continue to have its services online until further notice. Our board of directors and board of elders have been having conversations uh, about our plan for re-entering into the building. We have uh, healthcare professionals and uh, doctors and, and those that are gathering information that will allow us to make the right decision as to when we will go back into the building. You and I both note that Jesus had an amazing ministry without a building. So we too can continue to still uh, reach out and share the love of Jesus, disciple others, uh, evangelize and fellowship even without a building. So I want you to just remain prayerful, continue to do what you're doing, continue to follow the guidelines of the CDC and remain safe, remain at home. If you don't have to go, go out, don't go out. So we want you to just to take care and be safe and continue to watch us online. Listen, worshiping from the couch, it can't get any better. I pray that you've been blessed by the online worship experiences that take place on Sundays and the Bible class that take place on Wednesday. Uh, I pray they've been feeding your soul and you've been growing in the word of God as you've been watching. But until then, I know you're asking the question, well, Pastor, when are we gonna come back? And when we're going to be able to fellowship and when we're going to be able to throw our arms around each other. My answer to you is soon, but not yet. So until then, let's continue to just be safe, uh, follow the guidelines that have been given to us. And at that appointed time, listen, we'll be able to come and gather and fellowship with one another and enjoy the presence of the Lord. Now, what we'll be doing, um, as I stated before, continue, we'll continue to have conversations uh, because I, as your pastor, want to make sure that when you do enter back into the building, that is an environment that is safe um, and that also beyond that the environment is safe, that, that we have a plan in moving forward of how we will do ministry in the future. So for the remainder of this month, the month of May, we will continue to have our online worship ex experiences. And in the month of June, we will do the exact same thing. We will continue to evaluate uh, and watch closely the things that are taking place. And then prayerfully by the month of July, we'll be able to come back and fellowship once again with each other. Until then, be safe, know that I love you, and may the peace of God be with you. Shalom.